Hi guys, I've got another shopping haul for you. So I've just had my Tesco shop delivered. I'll turn the camera around and show it to you as is in the bags. And then what I'll do is I'll spread it all out and take you through sort of all the different departments um, of the bits and bobs that I've got. Right, so just been delivered and it's literally just dumped everywhere. So it's all over the table. And it's over here. And then it's also a few bits that have been popped over here. So this is a two week shop, but I haven't actually included any of the fresh things as in um, fresh fruit, fresh vegetables, um, salad. I've still got lots of salad to use up. Um, so if I need to pop out during the next couple of weeks just to top the shop up, it will only be literally for fruit, bread, vegetables and salad. All right, I'll show you what I've got. Right, so I'm just yeah. going to start this end of the table with the drinks. Here I've got nine bottles of the sugar-free lemonade. So there's nine altogether of these. And then two of the no added sugar, the pink lemonade. A bottle of juice, which is the cherries and berries. This is the squash. Open with the drinks, I've got four jars of the Cartnor. Um, it is actually called Law now, but I think these are just maybe some of the older jars that they're trying to sort of use up. But um, yeah, favourite coffee of mine. So I've got four of those. And then sticking with the drinks, two of the Tassimo hot chocolates. It's the Cadbury's hot chocolate. So they were on offer. We've got the milk at the back here. Look, can you see the milk? So I've got four litres there of the semi-skinned UHT milk here. Um, a pack of nine toilet rolls because I only needed to get some to top up. Three of the jumbo rolls of kitchen towel. And then on to some of the cleaning products. Um, this Flash Kitchen Recent Effect Fresh Citrus scent um, so it's a flash with fairy so I haven't used that before so I thought I'd give that a go um, I intend to give my oven a clean so I picked up this I haven't used this one either but I have heard some good things about it so I'm going to give that a go um, needed some more washing liquid so I decided to try this one this is a new one to me and it's the as you can see it's the surf coconut bliss then this was oh gosh this was on offer as well um the comfort uh strawberry and lily new fragrance i don't know if i rub that does it smell let's have a look no <laughs> it just says it's a new fragrance but yeah eager to try that one um some bath matics so use one side as like a scourer and the other side is more of a sponge um, there for the bathroom but to be fair i use one downstairs as well the, and then here i've got a pair of marigold gloves because i'm going to be cleaning the oven i thought i'm going to get some gloves um, these these scourers i used to use these years ago i haven't used them for such a long time but i thought because i'm doing the oven i might need a little bit extra you know elbow grease so I thought I'd get those um, for the bathroom these Fred and Flo the uh, the toilet wipes these are the sensitive ones um, of which I do keep one pack aside for my dogs yeah Teddy being a Pomeranian you know he's quite hairy down there so I have to make sure that he's clean um, and this is only here because to be honest, this is the only cosmetic thing that I picked up was um, some more cotton pads that I needed. But we dog food. Um, this is just mixer, so it's not complete food. So we thought we'd try this, and it's the small dog one. It's the tiny little things. And my dogs actually prefer this. They really like the tiny little biscuits. So with the dog food still, picked up two of these. Um, these are the winner lot perfect portions and they're Sunday dinner flavour. Here you've got turkey, potato and carrots and gravy, 
beef potato peas in gravy, chicken potatoes and green beans in gravy. So I've picked up those, give those a go. And um, these are new to me as well, the pedigree loaf pouches. I normally get the pouches, uh, the ones in jelly, sometimes the ones in gravy, but this is the loaf and that is quite new to me. Um, so I thought I'd try them on that. So I've got four boxes of those. Um, they've also got a box here of the meaty roll treats and 28 dental sticks there. Stall cupboard wise, two packs of the four tins of the baked beans and this is with the no added sugar in here. Um, and then I've got two packs of the, there's four per pack of the Napolina peeled plum tomatoes. Um, two tins of corned beef then here I've got some brown sauce onion and garlic pasta sauce the white sauce for lasagna I do usually make it but it's a bit too warm at the moment to bother um, some cooking curry sauce this is the Rogan Josh and some sweet and sour and then I've got some mango chutney to go with the curry I've got a pack of the easy cook basmati rice two packs of the pen pasta oh, two boxes of the large free range eggs so there's one two there and then I picked up these because these were on offer this week so here are the Coleman's I think I've got um, a couple of different brands here but Coleman's here I've got um, the hot chilli con carne sausage casserole cottage pie and cottage pie the Schwartz I've got barbecued pulled chicken American barbecue sausages two of those I've got two of those and then chicken jambalaya I've got, so now onto the frozen bits that I've got um, I've got a bag of the mixed vegetables with red peppers a bag of the whole green beans and a bag of the farmhouse mixed vegetables. Got six packs of jacket potatoes. There's two per pack. So I've picked up, as I say, we've got two, four, six, eight. So there's 12 jacket potatoes in here. Now fridge stuff, two packs of the extra mature cheddar cheese, some anchor spreadable butter, two packs of the boneless smoked haddock fillets, Grab those for dinner tonight. And here I've got four packs here of the um, the smoked, smoked back bacon rashes and these are the thick cut ones, you can probably see how thick they are, yeah. Um, two gallon steaks, that's, I'm going to do a, I'm going to do a mixed grill with those. I've got some diced pork, so I'm going to do sweet and sour pork. Um, ten minted lamb kebabs for another meal. I've got pork mince, so I'm going to do some chilli wraps. And I'm also going to make some scotch eggs out of this. And then out of the three for ten, I've got mango, coconut and lime chicken so these are the mini fillets um, I picked up this as well the pork leg roast with bacon and stuffing and these great big pork sausages there's 16 in here and they're, they're huge um, and then over here I've got minced beef that's going to be for the curry and then over here I've got the minced steak that's going to be for the cottage pie and the and a lasagna and then last but not least, I've got um, a bag of the miniature potatoes, another bag of jacket potatoes, but not necessarily for jackets. I just like the bigger ones to be able to sort of peel and uh, roast. So, And then in here I've got two olive rolls in here. Um, I've got two poppy seed rolls here. And in here I've got four seeded paninis in here. Yep, that's everything that I got in the shop today. Um, I did order two bags, they were kilogram bags of chicken breasts.
substitute. They didn't have any of those available and they didn't have anything that was suitable as a substitute. So I will, unfortunately, need to go and get those. But, you know, I don't need them today, so it's not a problem. I'll give them another day. And so, yeah, I'll tell you how much I spent. I spent a total of £163.91. That's for two weeks shopping, as I say, apart from I do need to go out and get some chicken breast and um, things like fruit, salad and bread. But apart from that, I am not going to spend any more on my shopping in the next two weeks. So I don't think that's bad, considering I've got like cleaning materials, I've got dog food. Um, yeah, I think it's actually quite a good shop. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this Tesco haul. Uh, if you want to see another one, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye for now. Bye.